Hello everyone, welcome back once again to travel vlog. I don't know what this is, uh, just a vlog. Um, so just a quick update, as you saw in my last video, I am traveling again. Uh, so I figured I'd take a video to kind of tell you where I'm at and what I'm doing. Um, didn't really get to film too much, like I said, uh, a lot of family stuff going on and just wasn't able to film at the time. Uh, so, where have I been and what have I been doing? Uh, well, we left Florida, which is where I've been living temporarily, and we went to Iowa for my family reunion. Um, I don't know if I mentioned that in the last video or not. Uh, we do a family reunion every year. Sorry if my hand is shaking. I'm trying to hold the camera and talk at the same time. Um, so we have a reunion every year, and I used to go all the time as a kid, kind of lost interest in it when I was a teenager, which a lot of the teenagers in our family seem to do. Um, started going again around my late teens, early 20s, and it had changed a lot since then, and adult things started getting in the way, like having to work to pay bills and things. So a lot of times it, it would come up on days where I just didn't have the money to do it because, you know, I had bills and I couldn't take time off work because either I was just starting a job or needed to work to pay rent. Um, so for a long time I didn't go and I was averaging making an appearance like once every four years and then it kind of slipped into five and then eight and then ten. I think the last family function I was actually at was my mom's aunt's funeral, uh, my great aunt. Um, back in 2008 so it's been close to a decade since I made my last appearance at a family function and since this one happened to fall right when I was between jobs I was like oh you know what why not my mom's already going I'll just ride along with her so came up to the reunion um, it was fun you know it was nice seeing everyone again still not anything like it used to be back when I was a kid um, just the whole dynamic has changed quite a bit the family's grown so much a lot of uh, people don't know each other anymore, like the younger ones don't know a lot of the other younger ones uh, from different branches of the family. And uh, as usual, there's always some type of family drama going on that you kind of have to watch and make sure it doesn't boil over because it could ruin everyone's time, you know. And so we did that, I spent a couple days in Iowa, and now, for the first time in eight or so years, I'm back home. Um, I'm in Michigan, where I was born and raised. Uh, it's weird being back here after so long. Uh, I was fine going to Iowa, but as soon as I got into Michigan, like I just got this weird, uneasy feeling. Like I, I can't explain it. It was just weird to be back here after so long. You know, it's a place I've always called home, and now it's just it, I had a weird feeling coming here, and. Um, you know, I was going to go around and see some old sites and stuff, but if I felt that weird just coming into the state and, like, the landscape changing and stuff, what am I going to feel like when I go see old things that I saw my entire life? Um, yeah, so not sure about all that. Um, probably going to do some of that stuff tomorrow. Oh, I can't hold this camera with that hand, sorry. Um, I was planning on going and seeing some stuff either today or tomorrow. I'll probably shoot some video, depending on who's with me. Um, a lot, of, Like I said, I haven't done much videoing because either my mom or other members of my family have constantly been around me and it's just hard to film on my own and have like quiet time without someone coming into the room or um, you know, calling for me because they're ready to go out to eat or something. And Right now I just got the day to myself. My mom's out visiting some friends that she hasn't, that she hasn't seen in a while and my aunt, whose house I'm staying at, is at work, so uh, won't be seeing anybody for at least a couple hours so I can sit down and film for a minute. Um, I can't film too much though because I gotta save room on this camera because my aunt actually dug out my grandma's old cookbooks the other day and I've been going through them and finding all the old recipes I used to like that she made so I can uh, try making them again. Um, I don't have a scanner or a computer here so I've just been snapping pictures of them with my phone. Hopefully they turn out. Uh, but I gotta save space for those, so can't do too much in videos on this phone. Um, what else to talk about right now? Not really a whole lot. Sorry about my hair being a mess. I just got out of the shower. Uh, yeah, so 
not sure if this will just be one video and then I'll do another video when I go places or if I'll do them all as one video. Uh, but there should be another video following this one that shows some of the things uh, from my childhood. It's about all I got left is landmarks, um, other than what's in storage, which, as you guys saw, wasn't a whole lot from my childhood. Um, yeah, so that's it for this episode, I guess. Uh, just kind of giving you guys an update of what's going on and where I'm at. And, oh, um, the other thing, we were going to be here doing another family get-together, because I guess my immediate family missed Christmas gathering this past Christmas, so they're doing it now. Uh, immediately following our whole family reunion. We're having a smaller family reunion. Um, but, whoops. Uh, but just this morning, as I got up, we got a phone call that uh, my mom's other aunt, uh, my other great aunt, um, passed away this morning, um, just three days away from the reunion. So at least she got to see most of her family again one more time before she passed. Um, she was 90 years old, so she had a good run, you know, good good size life. Uh, I figured she'd be the last to go. She's one of the oldest of the seven siblings, and all the other ones either died early or have or currently have health complications, and she was always the active one, you know, the one who's always like, if I stop moving, I'll die, and, you know, she was always active even into her 80s. Um... So I always figured she'd be the one that, that outlived everyone and be the last one to go. Unfortunately, she passed this morning. Um, out of the seven, there's one left now. Um, so, yeah, once that once she goes, I don't know what's going to happen to the family reunion. It'll probably keep going for a couple of years and then die out because uh, it's been kind of dying out for years. I'm surprised they've held it together as long as they have. Um, yeah, so it's possible that we were going to leave here and go down to Tennessee and stay there for a day or two and let me look around for some stuff because I'm thinking about moving back to that area and then we we're going to head back down to Florida um, unfortunately now that she's passed we might make a trip back over to Iowa it's only like a five hour car ride from here uh, attend her funeral and then probably head back down to Florida from there instead of stopping in Tennessee but we might still stop in Tennessee I'm not sure uh, kind of overextended the funds that we had planned so kind of got to cut corners where we can and unfortunately this happened now I mean I guess it's kind of good that it happened now because we're still only a five hour drive away and not all the way back down in Florida where we'd have to take more time off and come back up um you know it sucks that she died but you know like I said at least it happened while we're still here and can attend the funeral uh yeah so not sure how much more I'm going to be filming at least one more video maybe two um, then once I get back home, I'll get back into doing other things. Uh, like I said, I'm finding recipes, so more cooking videos coming up. Um, more movie reviews are coming up. I have seen a couple movies. I just haven't got a chance to film them, film the review for them yet. I'll probably wait till I'm back home and can sit comfortably and have the day to do it. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. There's more stuff coming. Just be patient with me, please. Uh, actually by the time you see this video, because I'm probably not going to put this up till I get home and edit it, uh, you'll probably be seeing videos immediately following this one. Um, but yeah, so that's it. Nine minutes of me rambling. Uh, so, as always, thank you guys for watching. Remember to like, comment, rate, subscribe. You can share this video if you want. It's just a vlog. Not that important of a thing to share. Uh, links are in the description and in the corner if you're following on YouTube. And we'll see you next time.